Hey guys, what's up? It's Patrick. Um, the past few days I've been receiving a lot of messages and comments from you guys that you want to me to make a tutorial on how to make PSX work or how to get ROMs or whatever, everything that. Um, so I've been working on it for like three days or so and I found a solution to it. I found out how to make it work and I found a good ROM site for you guys. So I'm going to teach you today how to get PSX, how to get it working in order to get your ROMs. And also I will provide you a list of which ROMs are working, which games are working for PSX and which are not. Because I don't want you guys to have a hard, um, to waste your time downloading ROMs that you think is going to work but it's not. I only want the best for you guys and I hope this helps you guys. So here let's start. Um, open up Cydia. Then um, make sure you have the a source that is the zottd.com repo site. If you have it, I think it's uh, pre-installed in Cydia. Um, just go search, and then I want you to type PSX. There you go. It look. It should. It should looks. It should look something like that. PSX for iPhone, and just go click on it. So as you see, I have it already. Just install it, and that will be good. So after that, I want you to go out of Cydia. There you go. Let me minimize this. And now you will need a file called scph101.bin. Um, you're going to need that. Okay, you're going to need this file. Uh, I cannot post this file here because if I do, it's going to be erased. And you cannot use it. Like other, other, other videos I watched, they say they post the link to it and it doesn't work because it's going to be erased for copyright reasons. So if you guys don't have this... Um, just message me. I'll send it to you. Okay, just message me. I'll send it to you. I promise I will send it to you I'm not like others there that don't reply. Okay, I'll send it to you. So you will need you will need this file Let me minimize that now. I want you to SSH in your iPod iPhone Okay, first let's go to the application itself just click double click that And I want you to go to mobile go to media and then go to ROMs you will see ROMs right there it's right this one click on ROMs go to PSX and as you see I have it already I'm got this file just drag it there and it's gonna work and just wait for it after it's done okay what I want you to do is right click on that file on scph1001.bin click on it and then go to properties you will see a number here what I want you to do is make it 755 click OK and that should be good now we, we go to the folder of the applications go up There you go, applications. And then look for PSX for iPhone dot app. PSX for iPhone dot app. Uh, there you go. Drag it to. Um, drag it in there. And there you go. Do the same thing as we did. Properties. 0755. 755. Click OK. And we're good to go. So... I'm going to show you now. Let me bring up my iPod. Okay. There you go. PSX for iPhone. You should get that logo. Click on it. And and if the, if the, if it's the first time you opened it, nothing should be in there. I installed Final Fantasy Tactics already. So I can make it as an example for you guys. So uh, nothing should be in there. If you see the scph.bin there it means you did it wrong so just let me get back to the menu go back to the menu and I will show you where to get your ROMs right now open up a browser oh that's my bad Google Chrome's faster the website is doproms.com and it's a very reliable site 
because it works and it's completely free not like other guys who post there they asking for stuff for money for whatever this this size is free um okay i will post it in the link and you'll just go to it and download whatever you want so i'll type here my what i downloaded final fantasy tactics There you go. It's a pretty big file, so you can download it one by one. Download it one by one, because if you download it all together, it's not going to work. Just download it one by one. It's just going to take you like seven, six minutes max. So download that. After that, just extract it. You'll get a, file, a folder like this. And you'll, you'll get two files, .bin and .q. Um, go SSH. Go back to mobile, the first place we went to earlier. Go to var, no, not that yeah, var, and then mobile, media, ROMs, PSX. I want you to drag the ff the dot bin file in there. Just drag it in there, and wait for it. I'll be honest, it's gonna be it's gonna take a long time to transfer it. Depends on your connection, or also better, plug in your iPod so. It can make it faster. So that's it. I'm gonna show you now that it works. So let's play. Um, one more thing. Um, I made a list on which games work and which games don't. I'll show you the list right now. There are a lot of games that don't work. There are a lot of games that works, and a lot of games that are choppy and whatever. Here, here, here's the list of what works and what doesn't. So it's up to you guys what you want to do. It's not everything, but of course, try yourself. But here's a lot of stuff that you can download easier. So I'm going to show you Final Fantasy Tactics works. But it's a bit laggy. And it's play. I don't. Uh, it's playable, but I don't know if you're going to want it. There you go. I'm going to show you that it works. Just to prove to you guys. And yeah, please, before posting any dumb comments down there, please message me first. Um... You might be doing something wrong. You don't have to curse me, whatever. You know, I saw, I I've seen a lot of comments from other videos, and they're getting a lot. They're getting a lot of curses from other people. Before you do that, message me. I'll reply to you guys. Okay. So here, I'm gonna show you that it works. There you go, Final Fantasy Tactics is running. Uh, like I told you, it's going to be laggy. But I heard and I tried the Tekken, Tekken 3. It works a lot and it's good to play. So if any of you guys are familiar with Final Fantasy Tactics, as you see, it's working. And again, if you have any questions, guys, you can message me, comment, and I'll, I will reply as fast as I can, okay? If I don't reply as fast as I can, I will. I will reply to you guys, don't worry. So there. So if you still want to see what happens, how, how the Final Fantasy goes, here, watch. Just watch and I'll leave it there. The sound is also not that good. Because I read an article on it. It said that the the one who made this emulator is still working on it. But you can play some games really some games really play good and some don't so it's up to you guys what you want to do and if you have any questions again just message me please don't forget to rate comment and if you haven't subscribed to me yet please subscribe and if you find like other people there having a hard time with a uh, PSX why don't you come and uh, bring them to my page or to this video so we could help them all right Yeah, the swatch.
There you go. Final Fantasy Tactics. So, I'm not going to waste your time anymore. Go do it yourself. And I hope you guys learned something from here. Please, don't, again, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. And have a